Position 17 is a controversial California prop that has both parties divided. It aims to give voting rights to convicted felons on parole. News 11's Gianella Giglino explains both sides. A yes on Proposition 17 would give convicted felons on parole the right to vote. It would also give them the ability to run for office as long as they have not been convicted of perjury or bribery. The average parole for a felony charge is five years. California is one of only three states requiring convicted felons to complete both their prison and parole sentences before they are able to regain their right to vote. But Prop 17 would change that. Person served their time. And, uh, you know, pay their debts to society, okay? They should have a right to vote. The Imperial Valley Republican Party says they do not support Prop 17 and they believe that finishing a full sentence also includes the time an individual is on parole. Prop 17 aims to restore voting rights to about 50,000 people in the state of California. The majority of them are minorities. Um, to right the wrongs of the Jim Crow laws that still have a, a cloud over California's constitution when it comes to disenfranchising black and brown, indigenous and Asian communities. No taxation without representation is a political slogan. Supporters of this prop are reviving, claiming that felons are paying taxes to be released and go back home to their communities, pay taxes, work, raise their families. And the one thing that we don't get them is a, a fair stake in democracy. Prop 17 will be on the ballot this November. The last day to register to vote in California will be October 19th. Reporting in El Centro, Janela Giglino, News 11. Turning to